Army presents The Big Picture. An official report produced for the armed forces and the American people. It is rare in history when a man who has distinguished his name in war goes on to greatness in peace. But for George Catlett Marshall, it was a short step from a brilliant military career to his role as statesman, diplomat, peacemaker, winner of the Nobel Prize for Peace. Throughout his long career, General Marshall served the most enduring ideals of a free people. His record has represented the best in the democratic tradition. Walter Cronkite, distinguished correspondent, is our guest narrator as the U.S. Army proudly turns back a page of its own history to salute citizen soldier George Marshall. The Marshall family had settled in southwestern Pennsylvania a few years before George Catlett was born in 1880. At Uniontown, he entered a slow-moving world that was more a part of the past than of the future. Marshall's boyhood passed quietly, and the only contact this serious child had with the army he would someday serve came secondhand through his father's recollections of the Civil War. America's Indian frontier had only recently been tamed. And the stories of Carson and Custer were still fresh enough to excite the imagination of any boy. Looking backward over...